And staying on the subject of scams, experts are warning consumers to watch out for Facebook Marketplace cons. And News 10 anchor Sylvia Masters explains how to avoid Facebook Marketplace scams in tonight's IO Scams report. Facebook Marketplace can be a great place to find deals on items for sale around your neighborhood. Like any online classified site, the Better Business Bureau advises consumers to watch out for warning signs before handing over money to scammers. Scammers posing as people on Facebook and pretending that they have stuff for sale. Of course, it's higher dollar items, um, things that are going to cost you a little bit more to purchase, and they want deposits up front. Maybe they claim that they have a lot of people looking at it, or um, they'll hold off and keep, you know, allow you to pick it up tomorrow, but you need to pay the deposit. And then after those deposits are paid, they disappear. This type of scam is happening locally. One woman reporting to the Better Business Bureau, she lost money to someone that posted about a washer and dryer for sale on Facebook. Um, you know, she found some, some stuff for purchase on Facebook that she was interested in, paid a deposit, and then after the deposit was paid, the profile was gone, had her blocked, and actually spoke to other people who said that profile scammed them as well. The seller may also say they are out of the country, selling it for a friend or relative, or otherwise unavailable, making it difficult for you to see the item in person. It is hard to tell, you know, whether it's a legitimate profile, one that's made up. Of course, we would tell you to look into the person that's selling the product. Do they have, um, you know, track record of posting things? Has the profile been around a while? Do they have friends and family members in the local area? And then are you going to pay a deposit up front for something you're not sure if it exists? That's a decision you'll need to make, but if you do, you know, be on the lookout for this type of scam. Here are some tips on how to avoid scams on Facebook Marketplace. Check the seller's Facebook profile. Scammers may set up fake accounts. Some telltale signs include stock images, lack of transparency, no written content or content that has misspellings or grammatical errors. Always meet the seller and see the item before purchasing. This will help you avoid most scams on Facebook Marketplace. Don't send money for deposits without confirming ownership of the item in person or over video chat. And lastly, reverse image search the items for sale. Scammers may steal photos from other listings or websites. If you have a scam you'd like me to investigate, feel free to send me an email at smasters at klfy.com. In the studio, Sylvia Masters, KLFY News 10.